through time, you will know what it's like to lose. To feel so desperately that you're right, yet to fail all the same. Dread it. Run from it. Destiny still arrives. children this message right we come out here for the children of israel in the last days can i ask you a question man you see you seem like you want to know what's going on right all right and we come out here for our people in the last days right so can i ask you in all honesty what's your nationality yeah, still to get over here. Oh, i know i see okay. so and, wait, what did what did the irish do uh to so-called negroes over here in this land to the indigenous people in this land right here what are your forefathers guilty of in this land? Indigenous? You trying to say you was an indentured servant? I mean, my, my Irish were indentured servants. Yes. Right, so to the English, right? So do you do you know do you know that the uh, that the English, right? The Dutch, they gave your people jobs over us. I believe that. You know, your your forefathers, right? Was the was the uh, was the driving force of slavery. English was, but no, no, y'all, y'all was. They, they put y'all over. I mean, right. probably. Right. Okay. So when you look at us, right? When you look at what happened to our people, right? Let's let me pick this back up. Hey, come here the word, man. All right, don't just salute. Come here the word in the last days, right? So listen, bro. All right. When you see this right here, right? When you look at this, we hanging on trees right here, right? Yeah. Do you know that your fathers did this, dog? Right. You don't know that. Your fa your fathers, yeah, your people, yeah, yeah, yeah. The Irish, you, you claim it to be Irish. You know the original Irish was black people, right? Do you know that history? Since you claiming something? No, I'm asking. Do you know that? Do you know that history? Who was Sir William Wallace? Bring it out. He was a Scottishman, right? But he ruled those lands as well, didn't he? Right? Didn't he run through Ireland? Yeah, of course. You know that history, right? Who are they? I'm asking, who are they? Bring it out! Do you know? What I'm getting at is, is that they conquered your people, right? Yeah, right, right? And they ran through those lands, right? And eventually, and ev that's, that's how your people went into captivity, right? You know that, right? All right, so then that's when y'all came over here and the English put y'all in power and position over the so-called Negro and the indigenous people of this land. Right. Right? Do you understand that? All right, so now it's ringing the bell to you. So let me get Isaiah the 14 chapter one more time, man. Let me get Isaiah 60 one more time. All right? Let, no, it's not anybody. It's your people. Right? Hey, no, no, stand. You want to know what's going on, too? All right? No, it's not. No, it's not because you're white. All right? We're not out. And listen, if you would have came up here and you would have said, you know what? My father is a so-called Negro. You know what we would have said? We would have said, listen, we would have probably went through some scriptures. Hold on, listen. Negro. I'm saying Negro. It's a difference. You understand that? Do you understand that? Oh, okay. Yeah, so that's what I'm saying. It's a difference between what a so-called Negro is, which would be our people, and what they call Africans. Okay? We're not the same people, right? But so understand this, right? You're talking to the children of Israel. Right. I'm not no Negro. I'm not a nigger. I'm not a black man, right? I just sit in front of 12 tribes of Israel. Do you understand that? So listen at this right here in the last day. This is what the Lord wants for you to understand as an indentured servant, right? Understand, you're going to be a real servant, okay? You're going to be a servant of servants on that day, okay? No, no, under, under, under the one true God Almighty, under the children of Israel. Right. Listen at this. For the, the book of Isaiah, chapter 14, verse 1. Uh -huh. For the Lord will have mercy on Jacob. You, Jacob is our father, okay, whose name was changed to Israel. I'm glad you know. We're going to make sure you understand real well. Go ahead. 
for the Lord will have mercy on Jacob uh -huh. and will yet choose Israel. And will yet choose Israel. What you see right here, the 12 tribes of Israel. This is our people right here. This is our nation. This is what we, okay, go ahead. And set them in their own land. And the Lord is going to set us in our own land. What's your name? Tim. Who? Tim. Tim. Okay, Tim. Listen to the words of the Lord. And the stranger and the who? And the stranger. You're a stranger, Tim. Okay, do you understand I'm that? A child of God. No, listen. No, you're listen. You're not from the children of Israel. So you're a stranger. Understand that. That's your place. No, you're a stranger. Is everybody a child of God? Yes. Okay, let me get Romans the ninth chapter. Let's see. Let's see if everybody's a child of God. Yeah. Okay. So is everybody that's made from the one created the child of God? Does God, listen, wait, 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 wait. So does God love everybody? Get that real quick. Second Ezra chapter six. Hold on, look, look, listen. Does God love everybody? I'm just asking. No, 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 no. No, do you know? I'm talking about all of it. Does God love everybody in the New Testament? I mean, if you, so if you are a sinner. No, listen to what I'm saying. Does God love everybody in the New Testament? Yes. John 3 16 that's what you're talking about the Lord died for you in the New Testament no so the Lord died for Israel I mean okay so what is Israel what you just, Israel, we just told you right here Israel is right here pay attention okay you're not you're not here listen 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 you're not here understand this read this right here because I think you're confused you think everybody Listen, listen, you got to listen. The book of 2nd Ezra is chapter 6, verse 54. Yeah. And after these, Adam also, whom thou madest Lord of all thy creatures. Do you know who Adam is? Don't look at me like that, man. Like, come on, is that, do you know who Adam is? Yes. Okay, thank you. Read. Of him come we all. Do we all come from Adam? And the people also whom thou hast chosen. So you understand that, that there's a difference, right? He's saying, of Adam come we all, right? And the people whom thou hast chosen. Do you understand that that's a difference? Okay, I just want to make sure. Go ahead. All this have I spoken before thee, O Lord, because thou madest the world for our sake. So you understand that the, the Lord made the world for the children of Israel's sake. In John 3.16, right, and where then, it's talking about world, that's the children of Israel. That's not everybody. Do you understand that? No, do you un do you understand that? No, that's what the Bible's saying. Not what I'm saying. All right, go ahead. Read. Go ahead. If you do not repent and you are not a true believer. <laughs> Who's repentance for? For sin. Who's repentance for? It's your own sin against God. Okay, so is repentance for everybody? No, it's your own. But if you choose, Okay, so who is repentance for? Yourself. Who's yourself? What people? All, is, is repentance for all people? If you truly believe in the Christ, Can, then you... Then is is repentance for all people? No. Okay, thank you. Read. But that's not exactly what I say. I say if you truly repent, Okay, who, who can truly repent? All people? If, Anybody could. Anybody could? Let me get Acts 529. Right Let's now. see if anybody could. Read. Wait, 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 just wait. Just wait. Just hold on. Yeah, Moses, 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 you're absolutely right. Moses was a murderer, right? That's right. He was. What was so be it? What about it? What about it though? You you talking to, you you're talking about the stock of Israel. They they, they come from Israel though. You don't come from Israel. Just listen to the difference. Read. As for the other people, yeah, now we're talking about you. He said we talked about the children of Israel. Now we're talking about the other people, which would be you. Okay. You're outside of the children of Israel. Do you understand that? Read. No, I don't. Well, you are, okay? But I'm not. Which also come of Adam, thou hast said that they are nothing. God said that your people are nothing. That's right. No, you're nothing. You're nothing. You don't come from the children of Israel. You're 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 a lying Irishman that don't know nothing about the Bible. We, we listen. You gotta you gotta be quiet. You gotta listen. So it's talking about the children of Israel. Do you understand that? Okay, read it again. As for the other people, as for you, 
Tim, for you. which also come of Adam. See, because I come from the children of Israel. You come from the Irish. Read. Thou hast said that they are nothing. That they are what? That, that they, they are, are nothing. nothing. Hey, God says your people are nothing. Yes, he just said it. He, you're like spit. If I spit right now, that's what you are. You're spit. Bring it up. And has likened the abundance of them unto a drop that falleth from a vessel. See that? You're just a little drop of water, right? That's all you are. You're nothing. No, no. What I'm, no, what I'm doing is being truthful. The Lord said that ye shall know the truth, and the truth shall set you free. I'm trying to set you free and understand that. Listen, because I'm giving you. I'm t give me Isaiah 14 one more time. Listen, we're gonna show you. Read this right here. Come on, this is book of Acts chapter 5, verse 29. Then Peter and the other apostles answered. And understand this, Irish man, right, Tim? Peter and the other apostles said what? We ought to obey God. The, the, hey, Peter and the apostles said, We, the children of Israel, must obey God. Right? Because the children of Israel was given God's law, statutes, and commandments, Tim. Not all nations, read. Rather than man. Rather than you, Tim, because you come up here with lies. Read. The God of our fathers. Understand this, Tim. The God of our fathers, whose name is Yahweh, read. Raised up Yahweh, son. Raised up who you call Jesus Christ, Tim, read. Whom ye slew. Whom ye slew, read. And hanged on a tree. Hey, hey, listen, you don't have to be Jewish, right? You descend from your people, the Irish people, who are guilty of putting us on trees. So the same penalty that y'all put our Lord and Messiah on a tree, that's what your people did too. That curse is coming to you too, Tim. Yeah. Him, God have exalted with his right hand to be a prince. To be a who? To be a prince. Our Lord and Savior, whose name is the Hamashiach Yahweh Shai, is only a prince for the children of Israel. Yeah, Not right. your people, read. And a savior. And a what? And, and a savior. savior. He's a savior. Read. For to give repentance. For to give repentance. You talked about repentance, Tim, right? Read. To, to Israel. Israel. To, to Israel. Israel. To Tim. To, to Israel. Israel. Unto the Irishman. To, to Israel. Israel. Unto Israel, Tim. Israel. Uh, you got to deal with that in the last days, Tim, and understand that. Right? Read. The book of Amos, chapter 3, verse 2. Yeah. One. Start at one. Hear this word that the Lord has spoken against you. All children of Israel. All children of the Irishmen. All children of Israel. This whole Bible is for the children of Israel and righteousness, Tim. You got to understand that. Humble yourself down. Read. Against the whole family. Against the whole family of the children of Israel. Right, Tim? Right? That's the spirit of the Lord. He wanted you to see that sign. That is of the children of Israel, Tim. Read. Which I have brought up. From the land of Egypt, uh -huh. saying, You only. You what? You, you only. Understand this, Tim. The Lord is only speaking to the children of Israel. Oh, you right. nations have to understand that in the last days. Right? Right. You only. Hey, hold on. Stand right there, devil, and wait for your judgment, that's too. Right. 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 You only. That's right. Right. You only. Understand this, Tim. You what? You, you only. only. The Lord only did what? You only have I known. Have I what? Have I known. May the Lord only known us, Tim. You got to love that and understand that and deal with that in the last days, Tim. Our Lord ain't for everybody, read. You only have I known of all the families of the earth. Of all the families of the earth, read. Therefore, I will punish you. That's why we were punished, Tim. That's why we went into captivity, Tim. That's why your fathers ruled over us, Tim. Read. Therefore will I punish you. Therefore he's punishing us, read. For all your iniquity. For all our sins, all our iniquities, right? Not your people, Tim. That's read right. your precept. This is the book of Psalm, chapter 1, verse 47, verse 19. Bring it up. He showed his word unto Jacob. Showed his word unto who? Unto right. right. Jacob. I understand this. He only showed his word unto Jacob, Tim. Read. His statutes and his judgment unto Israel. His law, statutes, and his judgments would separate us from all nations, Tim. That was only given to the children of Israel, right? He had not dealt so with any nation. Understand that, Tim. Our Lord, whose name is Yahweh, right? Who put his son in the earth, Yahweh Shai, only died for the children of Israel, Tim. Right? And as for his judgments, 
They have not known them. They ask for the judgments of our creator, Tim. Your nation have not known them yet, right? Your nation is just now. You see what's going on in California? Do you see what the Lord is doing to the earth in the last days, Tim? He's destroying this place. Why? Because that's righteous judgment, Tim. For all of the crimes that your people did. You're polluting the air, Tim. You're polluting the water, Tim. And hey, the Lord has got to destroy you in the last days, Tim. Right? We praise ye the Lord. Do what? Praise ye the Lord. And we come out here to praise the Lord, man. Call on your how about shim your own shine, man. That's what we're praising in the last days, Tim. And you got to understand that, read. That's right. The book of Romans, chapter 9, verse 3. For I could wish my, that myself were cursed from Christ. Understand this, Tim, right? Paul is speaking in the spirit right here. He said he wished he could go through the judgments that our Mashiach Yahweh Shah went through. Who you call Jesus Christ, read. For my brethren. For my who? For my brethren. My brethren, my kinsmen, according to the flesh. According to the flesh, Tim. Understand, this is a fleshly thing up here, Tim. This is a spiritual thing up here, Tim. This is an Israelite thing up here, Tim. Who are Israelites? Who are what? Who are Israelites? Who are Israelites? We come from the children of Israel, Tim. We got to deal with that in the last days. To whom pertaineth the adoption? To whom belongeth the adoption? The spirit of coming back to Christ in the last days, Tim Reed. And the glory. And the glory, the kingdom of heaven, Tim Reed. And the covenant. And the covenants, Tim, the old and the new covenant, Tim Reed. And the giving of the law. And we just gave you those scriptures about the giving of the law was only to the children of Israel, wait. And the service of God. And the service of God that was only given to the Levite priest of the children of Israel, Tim. Read. And the promises. And the promises, Tim. The kingdom of heaven. The rulership over you nations. That's what was promised to Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. Tim. That's right. Read. Who's all the fathers uh -huh. and of whom as concerning the flesh. Right. Christ came. And that's the only reason why Christ came, Tim. That's you got to right. deal with that. Read your precept. This is book of Second Ezra, chapter six, verse nine. Separate. For Esau is the world. end of the world. Yes. Understand this, Tim. Esau is the end of the world. That's your father's, Tim. Right. That's right. Right. Your father is Esau, man. What? Right. Read. And Jacob is the beginning of them that follow him. And understand this: when 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 our nation right collapse, your nation, we're going to rule over your people, right? When the Hamashiach Yahawashah comes back in the last days, right, we're going to take all your nation, right, and put y'all in captivity That's for right. what y'all did to us, Tim, in the last days, That's man. Right. And you got to deal with that in the last days, Tim. No, you do got to deal with it, Tim. Right? You got to understand that, that for these crimes right here, you got to understand that, Tim. For these crimes right here, you got to go into captivity and slavery, Tim. That's right. Your people, uh, what you mean, Obi? Well, listen, you're going to be destroyed then, Tim. Right? You got to understand that, man. You don't have a soul. You don't, man. You are a man, mortal man who does not have a soul, man. Right? Only the children of Israel was blessed with a soul, man. That's right. So listen, understand this. What you got? The book of Matthew, chapter 15, verse 24. But he answered and said. Understand this, Tim. You got to love this right here and respect the word of the Lord in the last days, man. Right? Be humble and listen to this. I am not sent. The Lord who you call Jesus Christ, right? He was not sent to all nations, Tim. Understand that. We just gave you. He was sent to who? The nation of Israel. All praise to the Most High, man. I am not sent but unto the Lord's sheep. Unto the who? Unto the Lord's sheep. Of the house of Israel. Unto the lost sheep of the house of Israel, Tim. Right. Israel is everywhere. Oh. Hey, you're right. Israel is everywhere, right? Who right. 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 you got? Right. This is Book of Revelation, chapter 13, verse 9. Yeah. Yeah. If any man have an ear, let him hear. If any man have an ear out here on Glenwood Avenue, understand this, right? We, he he that leads into captivity. captivity. All you nations that led the children of Israel into captivity, understand this. We shall go into captivity. All you nations, all you heathens, right? All you people that are not of the children of Israel, understand this good, loud and clear. We, he that killed with the sword. He that killed with the sword, right? You was blessed with that, right? We must be killed with the sword. You're going to be destroyed by your blessing, by the sword. That's Sam Yahweh Yahweh Shah. That's right. Yeah, in the places, in the fight of the 
saint is the patience and the faith of the saint. The same Yahweh, Yahweh, Let me give Matthew 24 and 14. Right? All praise to the Most High, man. Right? Uh, Teacher! Right. The mighty warriors, man. Hey, give a mighty hand, man, to the soldiers of Yahweh, man. Bring it out, man. The fishermen of Zion in the last days, man. Going out on the highways and the byways, man. All right, we come to God as a nation. One stick in the last days. Right. 24, 14. Bring it out. The book of Matthew, chapter 24, verse 14. And this gospel. And this what? And this gospel. And this gospel that you hear out here on Glenwood Avenue every Friday night. Going out throughout the four corners of the earth in the last days, right? Read. And this gospel of the kingdom shall be preached in all the world. For a witness. For what? For, for a witness. witness. We come out here for a witness in the last days, man. That's to right. see these nations destroyed. Thus saith Yahweh, Yahweh shall read. Unto all nations. Uh -huh. And then shall the end come. And then shall the what? And then shall the end come. That's the end of my time, man. I'm really going to shoot, but I want to give all glory and honor to Yahweh, Yahweh shall. And death to America in the last days. Yes,